Hi everyone. Uh Yeah, it's 66 here. Hello Nabbit, how you been? Dude, it's been going. Guess you've been wondering where I've been. Yeah, where you been? Oh, I've been running with the wild horses in North Carolina. North Carolina. Anything interesting there? Oh, you should see the mares there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna play my favorite character. Oh, we're playing Isaac, by the way. You're playing Isaac. I'm playing Isaac. He's actually on his phone looking at, like, what are you looking at, Facebook? No, I've prepared some shtick. Oh, no. Like, you wrote it down for this? Yes. Are you, are you joking? Yes, Nabbit. I'm serious. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this, this, this can't be bad. <laughs> Nabbit, yes. are you familiar with the Riddle of the Sphinx? Um, the, the, the one that, like, you can't enter unless you pass the riddle? No, the one, what... What walks on four legs in the morning? Oh, yeah, yeah. Two legs in the afternoon and three legs in the evening. Uh, Do you know the answer to that riddle? Is it is it a sphinx? Because you said sphinx? No. I wouldn't have got that if, if you asked me that. <laughs> okay, let me ask you it again. Okay. What has... What walks on four legs in the morning? Okay. Two legs in the afternoon. Okay. And three legs in the evening. Is it, it's not man, is it? <laughs> that is supposed to be the correct answer. Well... Because he crawls in the morning, walks on two legs... That's not the right... ...in the afternoon. No, that's not... ...and uses a cane yeah. at the evening. I get that, the evening but... Is life. Evening, oh, evening is life. Yeah. That's very... It's a profound... But Why is so profound? But I have a different answer for you. Okay. Is because it, I know you're a gamer. Oh no, is it, is it, it's a gamer rep? Oh my god. off is clearly on all fours, much like a human baby. Did you look this up? You know I did. <laughs> it's a Pokemon! <laughs> Vigoroth follows, proudly standing on two as a man. Oh, holy shit, are you... However... <laughs> <laughs> I knew you'd like this. <laughs> I can't believe you did this. <laughs> Holy crap. Vigoroth. <laughs> Proudly standing on two as a man at the pri as as a man in his primite. Slaking. Slacking. Slacking has, however, reverted to a three-limbed stance, just like an elderly <laughs> man with a cane. <laughs> no way! How'd I do? That was amazing. <laughs> did you just like look up gamer jokes? Like No, I I I, I I tried to find. I was trying to think of something that was stupid with that uh, riddle of the Sphinx thing. Yeah. And then that came to me. So then I looked it up, and I'm not the only one that had looked for a Pokemon parallel oh my God. in that. That's hilarious. Just the fact that that exists, it, it's like crazy. I'm glad you like it. It's very funny. So who is uh, Slackoth? Slackoth is a Pokemon that. Um, does it evolve into Vigoroth? Yes, it does. Oh, and crap. Slacking. 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 Like, like slacking? Like gotcha. slacking, slacking off. It's a Pokemon that, um, it's actually one of, it's like the best worst Pokemon in the game because it just stands still and does nothing sometimes. But it's also really strong. Oh, you want to hear a gamer joke that I made up, Nabbit? Yeah, I'd, I'd like to hear one of you. Cause... What do you get when you cross Super Mario with Fortnite? What do you get when you cross Super Mario? <laughs> what do you get when you cross Super Mario and Fortnite? Please, enlighten me. <laughs> An Italian plumber that works for free! What? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> is, it, is it, uh... Fortnite free? Yeah. Is that the entire joke? It, that's a joke. <laughs> that's a joke, son. That's hilarious. Thank you. I made that one up. <laughs> I know you did. <laughs> I know, I know you made that one up. Uh, why does Link have no balls? What? <laughs> okay, why does... <laughs> why does Link have no balls? Please. Oh, no, you don't know the answer? No, I, why would I know the answer to that? In Triforce Heroes, Link attempts to solve a mechanical puzzle to gain entrance to the Lady Lair, rather than roll back into the small openings at the other end. Did you look this one up? Uh, 
Yeah, Link's falls know? crash into the wall and crumble. What? <laughs> I don't get it. What? What does it's, that mean? It's something it's, where there's balls. <laughs> it's a reference to a, a very like. A, I I had that game. game right? No, it's just an obscure game that nobody yeah. likes. Thank you. <laughs> like literally, nobody likes that game. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> well, I just had to have some kind of. Is that all? Uh, Are you done? I have this one. Okay. It's a kind of a long one. Oh, I got all that. Why not? Two friends who happen to be gamer nerds oh, no. driving to a Comic Con. I hate Comic Con. Break down on a secluded country road late at night. You wrote this down. <laughs> you wrote this down. Holy crap. That that is beyond me, dude. <laughs> You wrote they down bits for, for an episode. <laughs> they see a farmhouse and proceed to knock on the door. Oh no. Is this a farmer's daughter? <laughs> Are you serious? With gamers. <laughs> it's a, oh my god. Did you look up farmer's daughter? No, I made this one up. Oh, you made this one up? Yes. Oh, okay. When the farmer opens the door, the first gamer says, Our car is broken down. Can you find it in your heart to put us up for the night? As we'll find a mechanic in the morning and be on our way. The farmer says, well, I don't have any extra rooms, but I suppose you fellers can share beds with my two teenage daughters, Sailor and Moon. Oh, God. Yeah, you really did write this one. <laughs> <laughs> are, are, are you going to... keep. I got to keep the suspense building. Are you, are you really telling this joke? <laughs> but the farmer adds, on one condition, you don't go into the barn. Okay. Is he is he a gamer too? God. <laughs> Funny you should say that. Is that the joke? <laughs> is, he, is he like? I didn't finish writing this right. one down. I'm not you didn't finish box. writing the joke. <laughs> 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 you gotta be kidding me. No, I think I got it in my head though. Okay. The farmer shows the two gamer nerds to his door to his daughter's room and says he's exhausted from all his farm work and will be heading off to bed. <laughs> the gamers enter the bedroom of the two daughters. Yeah. Each is lying on her own bed, just wearing their nightgowns. Uh-huh. Like where this is going now? I, I have a feeling that the joke is that like gamers <laughs> don't have sex. <laughs> but they don't even like... <laughs> You know me so well. I feel like this is like... <laughs> <laughs> what else can it be? <laughs> uh, oh my god. You really... You wrote this. You like it so far? I I like that you wrote it. I'll say that. I find it very funny. <laughs> the older daughter says to one gamer, You can share my bed and your friend can sleep with my sister. We've never had boys in our room before. Oh boy. This is where I stopped writing. That's where you stopped writing? Yeah, I, I know what's gonna happen, but I gotta say it right. Okay. Take your time. <laughs> but I'm getting nervous now. You know I like preparing. Yeah. I can't. I just. I'm bad. I, I really am. I, when you. Like, I know you said you had something planned for the video. And yeah, I didn't. I didn't think you wrote something down. Yeah, I've been kind of doing it all week, a little bit at a time. That's pretty funny. So the gamers are pretty scared because uh -huh. they've never been in girls' beds either. Uh -huh. What a surprise! Yeah, what a surprise! <laughs> <laughs> so they try to, you know, say, "Well, hey, girls." We're, we're a little bit nervous. Do you have any video games? Ooh, we could, uh, you know, get to know each other better, playing some games. Yeah. So the girls say, uh, no, we don't have any video games, but out in the barn, my father has a collection of vintage console um, video games and also what are the video games that are that used to be in the uh, arcades? Arcade, yeah. In arcade video games. Why did you? <laughs> <laughs> I should have wrote it down. I told you <laughs> that he restored to perfection. Uh -huh. So the gamers say, "Yeah, well, 
he did forbid us to go into the barn. Daughter say, well, if you promise to come back to bed with us, we'll take you out to the barn and he'll never know. That's Is it? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> so the gamers go out to the barn. Yeah. Couldn't believe what was out there. I'm talking vintage arcade joust, vintage arcade joust. frogger, vintage arcade. I get it, I get it. Donkey Kong. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're just stalling now. <laughs> <laughs> vintage arcade Ms. Pac Man. Okay. You're stalling, go. Oh, I'm trying to impress you with my knowledge of vintage arcade games. I, I know you know what an arcade game is. <laughs> <laughs> I am old. I'd be more surprised if you didn't if you knew like new games. You know, I'd like to take this point to take a little break in the story. Okay. And uh, talk about something serious now that horses rights. Shut the fuck <laughs> up! <laughs> You know, we've been demeaned by humans for a long time. Yeah. Huh? And I think people should just just stop riding horses. You're going to get me canceled. <laughs> it's demeaning. It is demeaning. I can't believe they would do this to, to horses. Yeah, it's wrong. I mean, Maybe. they are the one true way of travel. Not anymore, they're not. No, no, no. Man no. invented cars. Cars are just a fad. <laughs> anyway, so the gamers spend yes. most of the night in the uh, yep. barn playing these vintage video games. Yes. By the way, he also had um, N64 consoles set up. Okay. Um, what other things? He had all the uh, original handheld gamer things. Okay. You know, I, I, get, I, I want you to add detail here. Do you want me to add <laughs> your <laughs> <my> joke? joke. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> so anyhow, the gamers head back to the girls' room uh -huh. right before sunrise, yes. after gaming all night long. Oh boy. Gamers. As soon as they get back to the girls, the farmer bangs on the door. Uh -huh. Hey, you guys ready for breakfast? The farmer says. Yes. He opens up the door and the two gamers are sitting there with big smiles on their face in bed with his daughters. Uh -huh. <laughs> Not where I was expecting. No, no they didn't. I know they didn't have sex. Continue. He says, What have you two been doing? Why do you have those shit-eating grins on your face? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he says to his daughters, I thought, I thought these boys were spending the night with you. And the gamer says, Oh, I, we have to come clean and tell you, sir. We went out into the barn and we saw your video game collection and we couldn't help ourselves. Okay. At which point, the farmer took out a two-barrel shotgun and killed both the gamers. Why? <laughs> I told you not to play, to go out to the barn. Is that the entire joke? That's the joke. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for enlightening me with your humor. Yeah, you're quite welcome, Habit. Yeah. I was working on another one, but I haven't finished that one either. All right, well, you can save it for the next episode. I don't know. I think we should try to work on it together. Oh, God. A Klingon, a Vulcan, and a Ferengi walk into ten forward. You, you do know that none of... Oh, well, your friends don't watch Star Trek? I, I tried. Okay. I really tried. They don't watch Star Trek. Okay. Anyways, continue. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are we trying to entertain other people? I thought I was only yeah, trying was, to entertain you. Once again, what do I care what they do? <laughs> <laughs> they already know I'm a big in there. I didn't know where to go with this joke. I didn't get very far okay. with it. So, so you, you, all you have is that. And it's a good opening though, right? An opening is nothing. The opening is everything in a good joke. No, that's literally not true. The punchline is just yeah, as Yeah, I don't have a punchline. Then you don't have a joke. <laughs> that's 
Vulcan and a Ferengi walk into 10 forward. Uh-huh. You could just say a bar. Uh, I like 10 forward. It's a reference. Yeah. Just All right, right. I think the way I want to go with this joke is that they're having an argument over what is the best um, characteristic yes. of a human. Yes. Of being a good human. Yeah. So the... The Klingon um, says honor. The Klinger. The Klingon. The Klinger. <laughs> <laughs> the Klingon says honor is the greatest because without honor we cannot be proud of our families and what we are. Okay. <laughs> and then the uh, Vulcan <laughs> says I think the most important characteristic of being human is logic because without logic we cannot clearly decide what is important in life and guide our families to a better future. <laughs> I'm making this part up. And now the Ferengi says, no, you guys are wrong. Greed is the best human trait. But where's the punchline? Okay. <laughs> At this point, Data walks into the tent forward, uh-huh. and uh, Guinan says to him, "These guys are having an argument over what is the greatest human trait." And Data says, "Why, that's easy. Being human, of course." I don't get that's not funny. Because they're not human. I know, but that's, that's not funny. That's so bad. <laughs> Welcome to Mr. Ed Comedy Night. <laughs> Mr. Ed Comedy Hour. Oh my god. Uh, do I have anything else for you? Please <laughs> You you wrote all that for for the channel? Yeah, you yeah, show so me. much show so much you can. <laughs> Thank you for enlightening What do you get when you cross Princess Peach at Among Us? You don't even know what Among Us is. <laughs> what do you get when you cross Princess Peach? A chick that works for five bucks. What? I don't, that doesn't even make because Among Us is five dollars? <laughs> you like that? Is that the you entire like that? joke? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Thank you. Holy shit, dude, that is so shallow. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that is the worst thing I've ever heard. Well, you know, it's not easy being a comedian. That's for sure. And a horse. That is true. A talking horse and a comedian, both. That is true. Uh-huh. Now I'm out of material for reals. So maybe I should talk about what I'm playing. <laughs> Are you playing video games? I am playing video games, if you didn't notice. Um, I, this is Binding of Isaac. The game that you've spent the most hours of your life playing. That is probably Probably true. you played this more than Kirby, I would say. Probably. I would having your young years. I would say that it's something, it's either between this or maybe... Hmm, I can't even think of anything. I mean, there's only one game, too. Yeah, it's one game that they update. It's got like three updates. And this is this is the latest and final, I believe. Yeah, so this character is Dark Judas. Uh, you may know the name Judas from the Bible. Because we traded Jesus. Yeah. I think there's two Judases. Dumb, is there? But anyway. Yeah. What did he do? How did he betray Jesus? Well, he ratted it out to the Romans and got him crucified. Basically, they were like looking for Jesus and um, <coughs> Jesus gave away his location, I guess. It's mm-hmm. an interesting story, I guess. Yeah, that's a good story. Yeah. I think oh, I like the Old Testament, buddy. Um, Jesus was like. I think the Jesus story is pretty long. It is. Yeah, I think it, I think if it was shorter, it'd be a lot better. Cause there's just a lot of stuff that doesn't really need to be in it. Like Lazarus and stuff. Lazarus, he uh, came back from the dead. Yeah, he died. He's a character in this too. Is he? Yeah. Yeah, they don't miss much. They really don't. Oh shit! 
<laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Let's fight you. That's... So, you like my gamers, the gamer farmer's daughter joke? Yeah, it was pretty, it was pretty fun. Right? Could have worked it out a little bit. Yeah, right? I think the punchline needed some work. It was a tough one. But the yeah, yeah, just I'm shooting him was pretty funny. Yeah, farmer, farmer shooting people is always funny. <laughs> <laughs> and the fact that they didn't sleep with his daughters, yeah. even though like they wanted them. Yeah. <laughs> That was, that was the joke. <laughs> that was the joke. The joke was that they were gamers. <laughs> that they were nerds. Yeah. I hate gamers, dude. I can't I stand them. <sighs> dude, gamers, gamers are hilarious, though. Because they are nerds. Oh, this is a boss. This is a dumb boss. This is the entire boss. That's what you do. Yeah, I really didn't need to name the daughter Sail or Moon, but I just wanted to remind you with that. Yeah, I, I figured that was the intent. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. That story could have gone on all night. You, you could have named every video game in the entire. I wanted to. You cut me off. You made me shorten it. God forbid you, you name every video game you know, which is like probably three I more games. Gone. I think I ran out actually. Yes. I wanted you to take over. I don't, I don't know any games. I don't know any games. I hate video games. Yo, ho, ho. this character's hilarious. Basically, he can run through people. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it actually. Yes! So this character doesn't get hearts. You have to get the blue and black hearts only. It's kind of a gimmick. Where are they? Huh? Where are the blue and black hearts? Yeah, you see at the top of the screen? Oh, yeah. Those are my, that's my hearts. So basically, you can only get blue and black hearts. But it's like, they're kind of rare. So you have to... You have to be more strategic with the lives you have, because you don't get a lot of refills throughout the game. So, like, taking stupid damage like that is really bad. You can get blue hearts in the shop. Remember when I used to be, like, actually, like, kind of helping you play video games? Yeah, I remember that. Like, yeah. Lego games? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But now sure. it's like, I have no fucking clue what you're doing. I can't wait to play Lego Star Wars, because we're going to play that together. Yeah, I look forward to playing a Lego game. Those yeah. were a lot of fun. Specifically Lego Star Wars, because I, I really like that one. And I it think, was really good. I think this one, not only does it look good, but I also just really like Star Wars. Yeah, you yeah, have been watching the... Uh, yeah, we've been watching The Mandalorian. Um, I mean, I've already seen it, but he hasn't. It's really good show. It's really fun. And, um, they're, they're putting that in the game. I think I mentioned that to you. It's going to be like a level in the game. Yeah. Lego. Yeah. That should be pretty funny. I think it's gonna be awesome. Uh, like, yeah, plus they'll bring back the guy with the mustache. Who's, uh, his friend. The Ugnock guy? Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. Because, I mean, they you... killed him off way too soon. Yeah, spoilers. That's definitely... Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, this show's been out Yeah. I mean, it would be another thing if I said something about the Batman movie. Yeah. Which was really good, too. Yeah. But, you know, I, I'm not, not gonna spoil it. That was pretty decent, so. I won't see anything. Yeah. Even about the way Yeah. Hey guys, read the game. That'd be a funny movie. Uh, Just tell riddles the entire time. You're not that easy to make up. I know, if I if I did riddles, I would do that. I just thought I'd get riddles. Also, why was there just a random boss there? That, that was a boss, and it was just there. So are you actually at a point, are you point, at a point in this game that you have never played before? What do you mean? Have I ever been at a point that I've... I mean, you've... I, have you completed this game, or is this no. new to you? This is, this specifically is not new to me, but there's a lot of stuff I don't have. Like, because they, they added a bunch of stuff, so I don't have it all. That's the monster man. It lets you does get that have a, Does that have a uh, pan in it or something? I believe it does. 
the Pan Pan is the the horseman. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that the is that Pan? Yeah, he plays the food with the horse's body. Oh, that's his name. I mean, I knew who it was. I believe so. The centaur. I didn't know you. I, I didn't well, there's know more than one Batman yeah. in the forest in the fall. Yeah, it's a comedy. They, they flash it by really quickly. Yeah. Next time I'll, I'll try to focus on it more. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty. It's pretty pixelated image because it's a pixelated game. But you know. I mean, I would sh if I get a if I get a trinket on this floor, I could I could show you the secret ending, like the new final boss. It's pretty cool. Okay. I can actually do that. I just need items. Like, I, I have a lot of items, but none of them really work together. You know what I mean? Okay. So what do you have to do? I just, just keep shopping? I just have to get lucky, honestly. A lot of the, like, at a certain point, if your run is like this, you just need good luck to save it. Cause I mean, literally, like just one item can really you can save the reflexes in this game. You do. You do. Check this out. So yeah, this character you basically stab people. Also check this out. Here's the thing. Yeah, that's fine. Monster manual. Just the monster manual. It gives you a buddy. Oh, the PHQ. That's a terrible item. It's like a PHP with fake. That's literally it. How long is this video gonna be now? I don't know. I just cut it off. You wanna cut it off? I would say. Okay. Thanks for watching. Um, video. Wait, I need this money. Oh. Look like. What is that? So, <laughs> that was gold. Yeah. <gasps> oh, look at this! What was that? This is the. Oh, wait, no, it's not. I was gonna say, it can be the thing where you reroll your entire run and just get completely different items. Anyways, I'll pause and do more. Then you could continue gaming. Yeah. Thank you.